What for? Uh, seven. Thanks. Sure. <laughs> Sorry, guys, because I'm too lazy to take the stairs. so loud? Hello? Gu guys, there's, there's no need to panic. Hello? Should we be panicking? Hello? Hey man, cut that out. No one can hear us. Bet you I could get it to work. Seems this buzzer isn't working. Really? How'd you figure that one out? When I pushed the button, it didn't buzz. Oh, sure. Laugh at the kid who's trying. Guys, come on. Just calm down. Guys, we're stuck in an elevator and nobody can hear us. Yeah, we know. None of these buttons are working. <sighs> Why now? What are you doing? Waiting for somebody to get us out of here. Mind your own business. If we work this right, we could probably get on top of the elevator. On top? Oh! Oh, dang it! These buttons really don't want to work. Hello? That didn't work the first time you tried. That door does not want to open. Hey, at least you tried. Just need the power to come back on. Well, I guess we're just gonna grow old and die in here. Oh no, we want to die of old age. Most likely just hunger. Hunger. I just want to get out of here. Uh, excuse me. Could you not? Oh, sorry. Thank you. We might as well get to know each other's names. <laughs> oh, oh, oh no, this is not going to turn into a kumbaya moment. Not at 9 p.m. on a school night. Who knows? Maybe this is how we meet our future spouses. Or friends. Oh, oh. Mm. What do you think that is? What if the power's back on? Maybe the elevator works. Um, what are you doing? Setting out an SOS signal in Morse code. Oh. Well, that makes sense. The power's back on, but the elevator still isn't working. What if the cable snapped and we plummeted to the first floor? You know, speaking of plummeting, uh, you guys been on that ride at Disneyland? Tower of Terror? I have, actually. It was terrifying. Well, <clears throat> normally I would love to be stuck in an enclosed space with four strangers. But, you know, I have a nursing test tomorrow and I haven't even begun to study. That's why you gotta focus on extracurriculars, man. What's it like being a nurse? Well, it's long hours and hard work, but you know, I, I don't think I'd ever want to do anything else. Why'd you get into nursing? Well, I, you know, I, I just wanted to help people. That's why I got into psychology, so I could help people not go crazy like my dad. That sounded good. Actually, that sounded dangerous. What if this thing fell? You never know. 
Uh, actually, we do know. We fall down and go splat. I'm too young to die. I still haven't seen Paris. You want to see Paris? Why do you want to see Paris? I hear they have good French rolls and stuff. Mm, French rolls. Wow, I'm hungry. <laughs> you do know you don't have to go to Paris to get French bread, right? Yeah, you're probably right. God, my hand stings. Hey, you're a nurse. Aren't you supposed to fix this? I'm sure you'll be fine. I thought you wanted to help people. Uh, I do want to help people. You know, I, I wanted to be a nurse because when my father was in the hospital, you know, it, it was the nurses that really helped him get through it. Is your dad doing okay now? Yeah, you know, we didn't think he was going to make it for a little while there, but thankfully he's, he's pulled through. I remember when my sister was in the hospital. Sounds serious. Is she okay? Yeah, she, uh, she was playing soccer and she was playing goalie and a kid landed on top of her and crushed her toe. Um, yeah, it was pretty bad. Uh oh. Yeah, she even had a cast. And I signed it too, I felt like a famous person. Well, I'm glad your dad's feeling better. Thanks. Hey, can you guys hear me in there? Loud and clear. Yeah, we can hear you. We'll get you out as soon as possible. One of the lines to the elevator is still down. You guys all right in there? Oh, we're doing just great. Yeah. Actually, we don't want to leave. We're, we're fine in here. <laughs> all right, let's hold tight. They got here super quick. Uh, super quick? It took them like 45 minutes. Hey man, that's quick for campus police. Oh yeah, so many parking tickets to write. Man, but with my hand like this, I'm not going to be able to shoot hoops like this tomorrow. Actually, I, I've been wondering, how long have you been playing basketball? A while. Since I was little. You, uh, any good? I mean, I'm, I'm alright. You know, I, I, I remember I used to play basketball back in middle school and high school. Those were the days. High school? <laughs> yeah, man, those were the days. Just, just being part of a team. What position did you play? Well, to be honest, I mostly sat at the end of the bench, uh, holding water for my teammates. But uh, whenever the coach gave up hope and we were losing by a lot, which was often, uh, then I'd come in and play. That's awesome. You still play? I mean, yeah, every once in a while, but uh, I don't really hold water for my teammates anymore. They said they'd get us out of here by now. Looks like our cherished time is coming to an end. I mean, this wasn't that bad. You, you guys are cool. I don't even know you guys' names. My name is Parker. John. I'm Heath. My name is Charles. You know, maybe we could, you know, play ball or something sometime, eh, Parker? We could always use another member on the team, man. <laughs> Give you another better chance of winning. <laughs> <sighs> you know, we should hang out sometime. Oh, I mean, like once we get out of here. This should be a freshman orientation exercise. Lock groups of people in an elevator together. Yeah, we can make this a weekly thing. Just now when we have tests the next day. I should get locked in an elevator with my roommate. Maybe that would help things. You guys don't get along? No, not at all. Last week he tried to burn all my clothes. Yeah, you guys could definitely use some time locked in an elevator. Sort of like a... Like a cage fight, but, you know, in an elevator. That could work. It would be nice living alone. Roommates, am I right? Yeah. <laughs> you don't have any roommates? No, I, I have one, but I only really see them between 2 and 3 a.m. Well, there you go, guys. Sorry about the wait. Thanks. It didn't, it didn't even end up being that bad. Yeah, thanks for helping get the door open. Absolutely. You know, I, I think I'll take the stairs. <laughs> this is my floor. Well, bye. Good luck with your roommate. I'll tell him you said hi. Wait, what? Bye.
Wait, you live on this floor? Yeah. <laughs> See ya. Thank you.